Uh, when we originally came to uh, at the end of 2021, we were uh, expecting to do uh, three full rehabs on 2nd Avenue in uh, Albany South End, 45, 48, and 50 2nd Avenue. About 900,000 of that million uh, was for construction itself. Um, we were able to go out and uh, uh, get our architect, we were able to draw up all the drawings uh, on budget. All the all that stuff, we put those drawings out to bid. Um, we went out uh, to local organizations, we went to the New York State contractor website, make sure to get as much uh, circulation as possible, uh, both as required by the brand and beyond that. Fortunately, what we got back uh, was the lowest qualified bidder. I uh, ended up uh, bidding $2 million for the three buildings uh, for the rehabs. Um, so, so we did go back to HCR um, and asked for that extra million, which was rejected. We asked for uh, the extra to do two buildings um, to finish 48 Second Avenue, 50 Second Avenue, which they rejected. But they did allow us to uh, revise the scope to do one full rehab of 50 Second Avenue which would be a three, uh, two unit, uh, three bedroom, one and a half bath uh, homeowner unit with a studio apartment um, as a, an affordable rental. There's two aspects of this one point, almost $1.4 million grant. A million of it is for the land bank and then 400,000 of it, just under 400,000 of it is for mental health projects. And what will we sell it for to a first time home buyer? Probably somewhere in the area of 175. So we're going to spend a million bucks. We're going to we're going to renovate a building, and then we're going to sell it for 175 thousand dollars. I would suggest to you that something is wrong. 